Hey guys, thanks for watching Ao Mei. Today we are going to teach you how to delete recovery partition in a safe way. Click like or leave comments if you like this video. Subscribe for more useful tutorial. When you use computer, you will find in disk management that many partitions on the disk are not displayed in your computer. If you look more closely, you will find that your status is called recovery partition. There are basically two kinds of recovery partition, Windows recovery partitions and computer suppliers recovery partitions. Windows recovery partition allows you to boot into Windows recovery environment to restore your computer when problems happen. When the recovery partition created by manufacturers allows you to press a specific key, Usually F9 for HP and F12 for Dell to recover your computer to the factory's full settings. Method 1. Remove recovery partition with disk part. If you have upgraded to Windows 10 from previous Windows systems, then the factory default recovery partition will not work normally. In that case, you should delete this recovery partition and reclaim disk space. 1. Type these words in the search box. In the listed results, right-click the disk part and select the Run as Administrator. 2. Type in List Volume to list all the partitions on the selected disk with all the partition labels. So you can determine which one is to be deleted. 3. Specify the partition you want to delete Using the volume number like this, select volume 1. 4. Typing delete volume. 2. Delete recovery petition with Alme Petition Assistant. Step 1. Install Alme Petition Assistant and open it. Step 2. Right-click on the recovery partition you want to delete, and select Delete Partition. Step 3. Select the method to remove the recovery partition, and click OK. Step 4. The recovery partition will be displayed as unallocated space. Make sure that is the partition you want to get rid of and click Apply to make the operation in process.